Chris from 40 Thrive, and this is just a little bit of reality I need to share with you right now. It is approximately uh, 10 after 11 in the evening, and I just got home from uh, a very intense day at work. It was a good day at work. We were busy today, which I'll take that any day, but it was a very challenging day. Um, I woke up uh, this morning with uh, a pounding headache. Uh, I'm sleep deprived. I was not able to fall asleep till around 2, 2.30 in the morning. Still trying to get to the bottom of that anomaly. I've never suffered from insomnia like this before. Um, but I came home and I feel hungry. Uh, I feel disoriented because of just the headaches. I've been drinking as much fluid as possible, getting in as many um, electrolytes as possible. I, I can't figure out for the life of me why I have this headache. Uh, <clears throat> but something amazing happened today. Um, it is not often you, or maybe you do. Some of you might have someone that you really uh, connect to in your lives, maybe even look up to, and you have the um, good fortune to be able to uh, stay in close contact with that person. Uh, the person that really changed my life um, was my boxing instructor, um, who is a, a much younger person than me. And even though we come from two very different backgrounds, we, we just share a very similar mindset together. Uh, and uh, I was thrilled today, even though I was fighting off this really, really uh, painful headache, and I couldn't wait to get home. Um, it was just a, such a, some days you just don't have the choice to, to just clock out uh, when you own a business, and you can't predict who's going to walk in your door, and very often uh, there, there are people that walk into my door that I know that they're excited to, to, to have a con conversation with me, and I'm equally as excited to see them, but just due to my own limitations, I have to put the boundaries down and say, I'm, I'm sorry, but I need to go home. I've been here far too long today. Well, I almost had that scenario today when my mentor came in to my brewery and I haven't seen him in such a long time. I just realized my cabinet's open in the back and that's, that's just going to stay open. Enjoy that. Um, but, uh, but I just want to share a bit of reality. I came home, I took a hot shower to hopefully get rid of this headache. I feel slightly better. Uh, I really just, I want this. I bought this cigar today. I intentionally went out and, 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 and specifically bought this cigar because I wanted something to wind down with today. And I don't know if I'll be able to enjoy that with the headache that I have. But I also want to show you this. I, last night I did a video about uh, this big hunk of meat that I bought that I still have not worked all my way through. And when I put it away last night in the fridge, it was hard as a brick. I don't know if you could see this now. Uh, I just got out of the shower, so don't mind me. Uh, but this, this thing is just soft as a sponge after I just, I threw it in the uh, skillet with a little bit of bacon grease that uh, uh, from bacon that I cooked earlier. And uh, this thing is just absolutely amazing. It's got this beautiful crust on the outside um, from coming in contact with the skillet. It is tender and moist and juicy and soft on the inside. And it is just oh so delicious. So I'm satiating myself right now. I, I don't even care that it's so late and I'm eating because... Honestly, I'm in a caloric deficit. There's no way in hell that I'm eating enough. And this is just so good right now. I'm going to eat this. Hopefully I'm going to get nice and tired. And I'm going to go to bed. But I just wanted to share that. That it's been a chaotic day. But it's a rewarding day. And you can have both. You can have days that are just really chaotic. Um, and demanding. But in the end, you take the bad with the good. There's a lot of 
there's a lot of takeaways from today. And, um, you know, my, my mentor, Coach Danny, came in today with his new girlfriend, this beautiful young lady, and you could just see the chemistry between the two of them. You could tell that she is a very calm and peaceful person. You could tell that she doesn't bring chaos into his life. You could tell that he is just proud to have her by his side. And it's that sort of energy that I just found that very inspirational. And, you know, Danny and I, we just share a lot in common. We both grind. We both follow our passions. And, you know, they don't, they're not always lucrative, but we do it because we love it and we see the reward. And I hope that he realized and got to experience uh, some gratitude um, or I should say, I hope, I, I hope that my gratitude towards him, uh, for all that he instilled in me when it comes to resilience and perseverance, strength and discipline, I hope he sees the results of my labor and knows that that directly, uh, is a result, a result of what he instilled in me. So he used a term today that I felt was very fitting life is a beautiful struggle. It's a beautiful struggle. It is not always easy, but sometimes you have to pick your head up and find the beauty in what you're doing. And whether that is the, um, the changes that you are bringing upon yourself or the changes that you are bringing upon others and, and what you are building yourself up to be, you have to sometimes stop and just appreciate, even when it's difficult, you have to just be grateful for the fact that you can even put forth the effort to make something of yourself and work towards something. So that's it. This is how my day ends. I got to work at, what day is it, Tuesday? I got to work at 8 a.m. It's, I got home about uh, 10, 10, 30, and whatever, um, that's a, what, 14 hour day. That's basically my day every day, so, uh, yeah, you make the most of it. Cheers, keep watching, please like and subscribe.